Uh, basketball coach, you know how a town just rallies around a team heading to state. You've had that experience. Yeah, exactly, and it, it's just so uh, dynamic and a force to be uh, enjoy, and including one who's injured, not just the ones that are playing throughout a season. Folks get hurt, and this is a great story from Tyler Henderson. Heart. It's a term thrown around a lot in the Holly Bearcats locker room. In order to have a good, a good football team you don't just have to have athletes you have to have a bond senior lawn davis grew up playing with most of his teammates so we're all pretty close and i think that's a really big part of of our winnings now their bond is being tested after davis sustained a gruesome injury in their state semifinal game to be taken to the er and that my body was in shock suffering a shattered spleen having 80 percent of it removed just days before the championship game told me i might have to stay at the hospital for a few weeks and i wouldn't be able to and i told him i'd, I'd rather walk but davis couldn't just support his team from home a trait the community sees as well says mayor billy richardson the team has more heart they just don't quit. Being present, even if things are stacked against you, says his teacher, Charla Sims. Not be able to hop up and down and move around much, but he's going to be there and they're going to know that. Because the Bearcats take pride in where they come from. It's, it's a like tradition. It's, a, it's an atmosphere. Like We love to play football and we love, um, we love winning for our community and our coaches. It knows it's their heart and grit that got them to where they're at now. We would not be winning if we didn't have the heart and the coaching that we did. In Holly, with coverage you can count on, Tyler Henderson, KTAB News. Hey, thanks a bunch, Tyler. The community is also helping raise money for Davis's medical bills. My advice to all three teams playing in the state championship games tomorrow, enjoy every second of it. Oh, uh, again, you've experienced it, so you speak from, from history. It's a precious experience. Oh, that's great. Thank you, Sam.